Hello everybody, Bart here at Mastercrafts RV Center. And today we're gonna walk you through our 2024 Zinger 328 SB. Few things to point out, power tongue, power stabilizers, the nice steps, big powered awning, but I'm gonna go back to the outdoor kitchen first. Outdoor kitchen's huge. You got a big area up above, kind of keep the sun off of you when this big door opens up. Spot to put a TV or you can put other shelves or something up there. Here you have your refrigerator, your sink, your two burner cooktop. It uh, goes right in there, locks on up. Let me walk around back. Man, everybody's driving down the highway today. Got a ladder, you got your backup camera, you got your spare tire. I'm gonna walk over here, shut the door. We're gonna get we're gonna get away from our guy mowing the lawn here as soon as we can. This camper comes in just a little over 7,900 pounds. Two slides, two bedroom. Going on in, let's start up here in the bedroom first. The master bedroom has a queen, a couple shirt closets, and kind of that decor back there that's uh, nice looking. I mean, it's better than, better than just constantly putting like the look of wood everywhere. Uh, they've lightened up the interior in 2024. Nice lighter looking wood. Um, lighter countertop. No carpet slide. The slide is a lot closer to the floor now. A lot more flush than it used to be. Up here you have the entertainment center, fireplace, no TV. Honestly, we can install one for you at the same price or you can put in your own. Um, and do just as well as what the factory does. We got glass front in the kitchen. Drawers, plenty of kitchen space. Oven is a three burner. Cooktop from Furion. Big Furion fridge. I think it's a 10 square, uh, 10 cubic foot, if I remember right. Big, big freezer section. The big U-shaped booth, the long one, jackknife couch. Now Zinger does something to make storage easier. They kind of put a handle so you can get down under there. Okay, we're going to go back up and around here. All right, we're going to come to the bathroom. You got the radius shower, the medicine cabinet, the uh, sink and the there commode, and you got your own door to go in and out. Plenty of wall space if you want to hang up a towel rack, uh, all that kind of stuff. The extra door, for those of you who are new to RVN, that's so people coming in and out using the bathroom leave the dirt and the leaves in there. Let's go back to the bunk, because that's what's really special in the 328. This particular unit has a second AC back here. So it's a two AC 50 amp, but you got one, two, three, four, and underneath here makes five because you got a little cushion that pulls out to sleep on the middle of the big floor area. Five people can sleep back here pretty easily, and if they're kids, more. Got a couch, folds down. You got the, I'm going to pull this in here. There we go. You got the, the bunk area pops up and mounts up, so you got a spot there. Now, just to let you know, Second air conditioner, but the ducts also go up to the first air conditioner. So you still have air conditioning back here if that isn't turned turned on. Big area for a TV or whatever. A lot of people, they don't put TVs because the kids are looking at tablets and stuff. You buy a little mesh uh, thing that you screw in the wall there to hold clothes or whatever back there. And then you see you got a bunch of cabinet, cabinet space. I like the new floors. I like the the pattern. It's it's uh, different and definitely nice change than to constantly see straight lines of barn wood in every single camper. Um, big pantry, and we'll just do kind of a zoom around here because I'm going to try to keep this short for you. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The sink, pull down faucet sprayer. So there you go. Quick walkthrough, I do like the Zingers. They've always been a good seller on my lot, which is why at this particular moment, I don't have very many. I just got a few in because I sold out all the rest. But uh, 
Uh, the Zingers always have done done well for us, and the floor plans have always been really popular. Uh, it's a well-priced camper in this market. So, come on down, see it for yourself. Mastercrafts RV Center, Hopkinsville, Kentucky.